Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I recently just uploaded a video with my nice new service dog gear. I am doing an updated service dog gear haul. And it will include my new vest and on my last gear haul because I was ordering and uh, getting a couple other things in the mail. I'm still waiting for two more things. So after, when I get those, there will be another gear haul uploaded. And I'm going to put the old gear in plus the new gear. So I'm hoping you guys will enjoy this. And if you are new to my channel, please like, subscribe, and comment down below what you would like me to do. Like either a service dog outing or a service dog training video because I am a service dog handler and an emotional support animal handler. And if you guys would like to do a Q&A of what a service dog is, comment down below. Alrighty, let's get started. So, my first thing I will be doing is her crate. Her crate is a X, 2XL doll crate. She had an extra large, but she outgrew it. She just got way too tall for that. So, she's now in this. I moved everything downstairs because I'm cleaning my room. And I have the vacuum where the crate was, so that's why the crate's downstairs now. It's just for temporary. And then, so the next thing I have is her collar. Hi, Tommy. This is my ESA in Canada. There will be a, another gear haul for him as well. But I still got him. So this is her service dog, uh, her, her collar, doll collar. Nice job, So this is her collar. It has her service dog tag with nothing on it. It came with her other vest, her love doggy vest, which you will be seeing. Her rabies tag. And then her shop um, state tag. I haven't got her a tag with her my information on it yet because they're a lot of money, and her gear is a lot of money, and his gear is a lot of money. So this is her collar with the tag, and then I do have a no bark collar. Um, basically, what this is, it's for her to not bark it teaches her not to bark it is a, a no bark shock collar so when she barks seven times it will shock all those times and then at the same time it will give a warning shock and then it will progress even more with the shots it does not hurt um i can't try because i don't bark but she does not yelp, and I have it on the highest setting at all times because she barked a lot. Right now, the reason why she's in there is because she sees this. She don't like it. Next thing I'm going to go on to is her head collar. Now, she has other ones, but I can't find them right now. And I can't even find her brush, so I've been using his brush, which they use to have on the same brush. It's just a dog style. So this is her gentle leader head collar. It does not hurt her whatsoever. She may hate this on her face because she paws at it like crazy, but it does not hurt her. This one is a gentle leader head collar. It just helps her with her pulling 
She does pull. She is a heavy puller without this on. And I prefer this over like a prong collar because a prong collar will damage her trachea since she does pull heavily. And I've used a prong collar on her before and it did not work. She had holes in her, her trach and I just did not want to use it anymore. It did not work on her whatsoever. I put in the right spots and I'm like, no. This is not going to work on her. I'm not going to damage my service dog. So with this uh, training tool, I also use an easy walk harness. So with the easy walk harness, it has a martingale in the front. And what it does is when she pulls, it gets the chest part gets tighter. And that's what I like on her. The reason why it's been constantly turning is because it is a smaller size and I have to get her a bigger size for my next payday. So it's supposed to look like this. But her um, blades keep on rubbing off the fur. That just means that she has to get another one as soon as possible. But not right now. She's so, she don't feel uncomfortable whatsoever. She's just um, very hot. And she don't really like this because it pull, tightens her chest. She does wear a Ceresto flea collar. And those are a lot of money, but they're worth it. So what I do with this is I can have this on her. She thinks it's on her. And she's scratching. So what it does, what I do is I have this on her head, this on her chest, and I have a leash attached to this connecting to this. And so what it does, if I can get it right. So what it does is the leash will also move the martingale. And if she pulls, it gets tighter and tighter. And it actually does stay tight when this is not connected to her. It's like this. But it does not hurt her whatsoever. I'm not using it incorrectly. It's just how she the only training tools that she will work with besides this. And this, like I said, this does not hurt her whatsoever either. She just don't like it because it does shock her when she don't bark, when she barks. You're okay, Maddie. She does eat. And then Give me a sec when I left. I'm so charging. Oh. Okay. No problem. So the next thing I have is her leashes. Now she kind of has three in total. She shares one of them. Well, actually all three of them technically with my ESA. He has his own leash though, which is his working one, but I'm going to be getting her a service dog leash as pretty soon. So once when, when I get that, um, I'm going to go with an industrial puppy because I really like those service dog leashes. But also, she has a track lead on the way. It's a bio team. So, yeah. I have a traffic lead, but it's a nylon one. So, I don't really, I don't like the feel of nylon in my hands. So, this is I'm just a Dollar Tree 
leash. Um, I think it's four feet. I don't know. I use this on her other harness, her other vest, as a guide handle in a pull strap because her other vest does not have the three. The triangle, which you'll see in her new vest. And so this is reflective black. I don't really like on her because it, she is a black lab. Okay, baby. It's okay. I'm right here. I know you want to be out with me. You want to be out with mommy. You want to be out with mommy. Just calm down. Cool down, baby. Okay? So this is uh, just a standard size leash. I love the clasp of them though, but at the same time it is very hard. So it's back there. On to the next one, the leash. It is her traffic lead. I love this dog and lock this clasp because it's just a push in. And it and that works for me so much better because of my hands. I can't coordinate well. This is just a standard two feet, two foot leash. Traffic lead. And what I wrote on it was in training to be a service dog. In training to be a service dog and two parts on the side. So they both have different sayings on each side. And this is by the brand Newfine Pets, if I'm saying it right. I highly recommend these track leads, but I don't really like it that well. But I'm going to be getting her a vest. Well, I'm, I have another track lead being custom made in Biotin Teal because... Teal is my PTSD symbol and color, so that's what I like. Plus two of them, one of my favorite colors. Okay, Maggie, you're okay. Quiet. The next thing I have is a Kurgo 6 and one Quantum hands-free leash. I got this at Pet Value for when I, I had, when he got loose. I love this leash because I can put it over my shoulder, in my hands, make it into a long leash, make it into a short leash, do it the double way, do a double way, and a couple other things as well. I better get to her toys. No. Maggie, you're okay. The next thing I'm going to be going into, so basically what I said and was this is by Cardo. And I love this leash so much. She loves it as well. The next thing I will be going into down a little and have some new one. This was the very first phone that she got when she came here to me. Um, I rescued her definitely from another person that did not want her anymore. She was way too much to handle. So my mom got this file for her the day after. And then my aunt got this one toy. 
in little pieces. Um, it's supposed to, you're supposed to put any treats in and keep her occupied. Red does not work on her. She's a heavy chewer. So I'm going to be getting the Conga Stream. And these are the cheap brand from Aquali. So I don't really like it. I just put things in there to keep her occupied right now. She's just, she wanted her room. And then this was in the shape of a pig. I got it at the Cumberland Valley Animal Shelter thrift store. And it was a dog toy um, already used by another dog. But I got it because it was uh, hard and it's rubber. And I got this three months ago. And it still lasted. So she loves us. And then going with that red thing, this it came with a nylon bone. I love this nylon bone because it does help her with her teeth and her chewing. And it's lasted quite a long time. I'm very surprised. The way that she chews, I thought this thing would be gone. And yeah. next thing that I have, since she is a service dog, and there are service dog laws, and she's right now in training. Now, I know these laws do not cover her right now. It's just my state laws. But it still counts, because I got these in the future. And for now, I got 50 ADA cards, plus a uh, Five ADA cards came with her love puppy vest with that tag. And I have not used them at all except for one time. And I still have all 55 cards. I don't give them out that much unless somebody does not understand the ADA and for service dogs, then. This is where I come into play. I'll have these cards on me in uh, her new vest and on me. I normally also keep some in her tree pouch, which you guys will get to see soon. And so, yeah, I love this. And it basically tells you what the service animals are. So, like, I am a service animal, and it's my. A right is a company. My handler is protected by federal law. And this says, in accordance with uh, the Americans with Disabilities Act of 190, businesses may ask that uh, one is this is service dog. Do what task that does uh, the service animal perform? And then on in the back it says the other other things well so that's that i am owner training her myself so i'm not getting really that much help but by another trainer that has a service all and service all cameras and youtube videos. the next thing i want to move on to is service all patches um i don't have that many patches because i am a new service all handler but there's a bunch of them, two of them that I am going to be using in the future. But her new vest, I don't need to put patches on it except for an in training patch because it has service all on both sides, which I love. And so these uh, two patches came with her love puppy vest. That Her love puppy vest is a registry vest, but I did not register them at all. So what I did was, it was on this patch, so I cut it off. The register sign off. Leave it. Give me one second.
so she was chewing on the couch. You're okay, Maggie. You're okay. Let me go there. So these are the service talk uh, patches. They're not that um they're actually not even like reflective like my other ones. I like to have reflective patches because she is a black lab and it makes me visible. She's just right now playing with her phone. <laughs> She don't have that many toys because I get her toys and she just tears them right off. It's okay. And I do keep me occupied with training. Ow! I'm okay. I know you see your brother up there. I know. Do you see your brother? Do you see your brother? That's your brother. Sorry. Trying to keep her occupied and do this video at the same time. It's not easy. So these are not that very um, reflective. I don't mind, but I like them to be reflective. Do you mind? Do you mind? Do you mind? And then. Do I put that dark color on? Do I put it on you? Since that's a, is, she is a service officer in training, I do not want to use those uh, patches yet. So I went on the same uh, website and got her service officer training patches. I can the same as said as two. So, yeah. And then I also got a custom made patch because I want her to be recognized as multi purpose because she does do more than one task for my disabilities and does more than one area for my disability. She does a PTSD, mobility, medical alert, and medical response. So, this is where this comes into play. It's a multi purpose service organ training patch. Do not pet. I am working. No. Quiet. Quiet. It is a multi purpose service organ custom made patch by Canine Service Gear. Well, Service Canine Gear. And I love this. I have patched so much. I love the embroidery. And she did put the symbols on, which I love. So once when she, I'm going to still use this when she's out of training. But I want her to still be symbolized is in training because she does make mistakes. She is a lab. She is a puppy. She's nine, almost nine months old. So this is where she comes into play. The next thing I will be going into is her collapse of water bowl. This is just a water bowl to travel. Use for water or food. I can just clip this onto her vest and that'll be it. So it's by Pet Ami. It came with her tree pouch, which I will get to later. And then I also have an, another water thing. It's just a water bottle that you'll flip up and it actually does leak, which I don't really like this uh, that much, but you can squeeze it and it gives water. You're okay, Maggie. Good girl. And then I forgot this one leash. It's the leash that she came with. I'm currently not having it on. I'm not using this leash on her whatsoever. She chewed through it. I had to actually tie it a couple times. And I have dog in training. Please do not. Just 
contract. I'm working on both sides. I do not like this leak. It is way too long on her. I don't like the feeling of it. Give me one second. Gotta put that no bar color on. Oh, next time she barks, she will be shocked. Now that she has that kind of work color. So, I don't really like to use this on her whatsoever because of this shoot up. And it's way too long. The next thing I have is booties. Now, these booties are actually way too big on her, but I got them anyways, just in case her feet don't grow, which they have been. They're made by Kurgo. They're the Kurgo Step and Straub. Two and, well, yeah. Step and Straub by Kurgo. Dog shoes, I have the original box. They do light up, which I like because in the middle of the night, she steps and they can, she's easily visible. These are a size large, but she's actually a size medium. But I'm going to be getting her size medium anyways and just use these in a few parts. The next thing I will be going over is her treat pouch. Now, I don't use treats, I use her kibble. Because her kibble is more healthier and it's professional for me, they, I personally, for her age, it's better to use kibble because she prefers her kibble anyways. I gave her treats and she likes it, but nah. Okay. You're okay. So what I'm going to do is just feed her a couple of her kibbles and since it is time for her breakfast. I feed her around this time for breakfast because I just did finish school. I'm in summer school, so she don't get to eat until around this time because of I finish class around this time and I wake up late for like her to eat breakfast. So I'm going to give her some kibble. Now, I normally do precise measurements. So she normally gets two cups and one fourth. But I'm going to go and give her one size. Just one scoop of this one right now. So she can get something. What I do is I water it down because this is not something. And she's not playing that boat yet. But her. And they don't make water. So. That's where she gets the professionals, adults. I think it's beef savory. But yeah, this is The next thing I have 
is the very first thing I got. I actually did a DIY on. She did not have a vest at all until last month. So what I did was I went out to Dollar Tree, bought a marker, bought a dog bandana, put service dog in training, do not pets, talk, or eye contact, and everything. It's not my best work, but it worked. And to this day, I still use this, even with a vest on, because people still do not listen to a vest. And then she does have socks, but I bought them, and they're somewhere upstairs in my room, but I can't find them right now. But they're by. I got them all for Chewy. And then Bray's a bikini design. They're a really good brand and they don't sell them anymore because they're discontinued. But they're very worth it. I mean, it saves me. Apes her paws in the house, saves my floors and everything. She don't really like it, anything on her feet. But it worked to help them because she does have new claws. So I got these. Now, the moment you guys all been waiting for. This does have a effect like this. But this is a by the same brand, Pet Ami. This and this came together, which I, I liked. And I still like today. It's got a lot of room. It's got a place where I can put my cell phone, 88 cards. <laughs> she currently don't have dog bowls because she chewed them. So we use rubber bowls. She's chewed three of them. Hey, get more after. Behave, okay? Okay? So, the moment you have all been waiting for, and that is her two vests. She only has two currently, but I'm hoping that uh, I will get her bracing her mobility harness as soon as possible. I have to wait until a good paycheck again. Now, she has this vest, which you guys have already seen. And you've currently probably already seen her other vest if you watched my other video. And I like this vest, but it's a little bit big on her. Because I got a size large. I thought she was going to be a large. Nope. She's a medium. So... I'm not complaining. This does work in its purpose on her. I love it. It's got the, everything I wanted for a vest. And even if it's a registry vest, I don't care. I love this one because it stays on there and it says official service all gap tabs. So this one. Okay. Behave. It's got three Velcro patch areas, so it's got a patch. I can put a patch here, a patch on this side, and a patch on this side. It had a D-ring up here, but it decided to break. So I actually do not like it here anyways. So I like it actually this way because I don't need to put I don't put nothing on there. The only thing I put on her on there was her tags. And I can put her tags right here. I can put them on her collar. I can put them on her, on her easy walk harness. I can even put on her other her vest. So, yeah. This is actually the server. Her, it's purpose. I do put it, put it down. It's got the cooling gel in it. And it does work. Hello. So, it does serve its purpose as a server. 
Okay. I'm gonna ignore that. She is getting shocked. So the next five vest I have is the vest I just got today. I love this vest. I took her out in it just to try it out. I got it for the winter time because in the state of PA it does get very cold out. So I got this because of that. But then also in the summertime at night, it does get pretty chilly. And her other vest does not keep her warm. It keeps her cool. So this is a padded vest. And what I like about it is I can put my pull strap on here when I get it. Because it's got the 3D rings. Which I like. And then it also came with this uh, pouch where I can. Let me go grab my cell phone. Come back. Where I can probably even put my cell phone in. And I can. I want her to start carrying things for me. So she can carry. My cell phone. She can carry some ADA cards or a whole stack. She can carry my charger. I never stopped this thing uh, before because I just got it today, so I'm just in the limit. It fits a lot which I love. It won't necessarily fit my um, EpiPen, which it is a sad thing, but I can even use this for like medications and a couple other things as well, which I don't mind. I can put an A, I put in, always have an ADA card here and I would be putting an uh, instant serve for multi-purpose serve solve. In training patch here, or a service dog training patch. I can just slide it in because it does say service dog on it. But she's in training, so this is completely different. <laughs> so this is she would be making easily be identified as a service dog in training. Yeah, I'm in my room, but I gotta go upstairs and vacuum. Then I can put your cage back upstairs. Shifty. Shifty. Canines are coming in. Ow, that hurt. That hurt. That hurt. She's in a plane mood right now, so. I know I train her around this time after I do school. So she's in a play mood. She don't like to be created the whole entire time. But I love her best. This is actually a size medium, which fits her perfectly. I will be getting her a smaller size of this. So in the future, I'm still going to have this on me. But I will still have this in the future. So what I like also about this vest is I can put, all I have to do is get Velcro, stitch it on, and then patch right here. Patch there, patch there, and I can put a patch here. So another thing I like. It's already got service dog on it, so I won't need to put patches on when she's not 
and training, which I'm hoping this vest will still fit. It is padded. It's also a breathable um, padded. So I did take her outside in this, and it is 90 degrees out. And yes, it did make her hot. So it's not made for this kind of weather, but it's not wonderful. It does have spot clean on this. I can only be spot cleaned. So I can put this in the washer dry and dryer. Well, the washer and I would have to air dry this. It is made by Paws and Pals just for them. They only make service dog gear, which I love. Now, on Walmart.com, it says it's also for pets. No, it says service dog ones. So if you're going to get a vest, please, and it says service dog on it, please, 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 make sure you do have a legitimate service dog. Because if I see a pet yapping in a store or in a cart, I will pop spot you out and i will tell you that's a fake service dog get your dog out my service maggie is a legit task trained service dog she is in training so she's being learned and taught how to be a service dog she may make mistakes but she owns up to those mistakes she gets all of the other consequences as a legit service result. So if she don't, let's say she's having a bad day and she decides to pull me, I pull her back and I will correct that behavior. I know what service logs are. I've been looking up service logs for over two years. So if I see a fake service dog in the store, yeah, betcha I'm going to call you out. So, that's pretty much all of it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please like, subscribe, and comment down below what you would like me to do next. All right. Thanks for joining. Bye. <laughs>